Hello everyone, today I'm gonna play this game the second time. Then we make this part. But now we're gonna play this part. So let's get into it. Let's get going. Yeah. Ah, interesting. Yeah, yeah. And if you sure. Yes, a puppy. I will make maybe short too. Maybe. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. A creepy build? Okay. No. Oh, hello. Cannot, cannot. Yeah, yeah. Why? Oh, more stuff. Why? <laughs> Does someone need a hug? Give me a big squeeze. I promise I won't bite. Are you sure? Come closer, friend. And I'm dead. Yeah. Let's keep going and fuck you. By the way, you need to collect those. Yeah. I don't know why, but yeah. Playtime Co. is the product of a great man by the name of Elliot Ludwig. Divorced, but a family man at heart. His sights were always set on bringing amazing toys to amazing children around the globe. Ludwig spent countless hours in the factory, working overtime relentlessly in an attempt to continuously innovate and surprise. In the 1960s, an unfortunate family death had pushed Ludwig down to his lowest. But with so much ambition, he rose back up and continued to fulfill his vision for the Playtime Co. toy factory. Ludwig could never be content leaving a project unfinished. But just how did one man come to create such an astounding empire? How did he manage to stay determined even after suffering such a tragic loss? It all began in the fateful year of 19... I think he killed our family to create those Bobby and Mommy. Oh, uh, sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. I was just trying to get the power back on. Here. Good, baby. I'd like to pay you back. Pay me now. There's a train station nearby. It needs a coat, and I have it. We're gonna get out of here. As soon as you get on up here. <laughs> Come on. While I'm still a doll. <laughs> uh, don't you want to come with me? You're making me sad. Nice. Hey, I'm up here. I see you. <laughs> I 
should be able to follow you through the fence. This way. Oh, no. That. Give it back. He got a call. She got a call. Ow. 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 Hey, give it back. She got a call. Nope. No, thank you. Nope. No, 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 no. Okay, no facts. Isn't this exciting, Bobby? Very exciting, Mommy. <laughs> Mommy heard that oh, this you, you Bobby was going to just give you the train code to escape. Now, how is that fun? It's fun. Instead, why don't we make a game out of it? The game station is still working. It will be it's just bad. like old times. Fuck you. And if you win all three games, I'll give you the train code. <gasps> Mommy loves that idea, Puppy. Oh, you're going to have so much fun. Fuck Head you. Head to musical memory, and Mommy will get things started. Obey the rules, or I'll tear you apart and eat your insides while you're still alive. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. Well, we need an another one. God damn. Whoa. Maybe it's not, and why is lagging this one? Why? God damn. What in the world?
By the way, we need to, we need to clip that one. Yeah. Otherwise, it's not going. I like it. Sure, you don't look down. Welcome to musical memory. This advanced memory and cognitive recognition test is designed to stimulate several segments of the brain, allowing us to see how quickly and efficiently your brain works. A sequence of colors will be shown and you must recreate the exact sequence using the buttons around you. Bunzo will slowly lower towards you. When you complete a color pattern correctly, Bunzo will rise back up. When you input a pattern incorrectly, Bunzo will lower towards you faster. If Bunzo reaches you, your <laughs> test is over. The test will become more difficult as it continues, with longer patterns in quicker succession. That's all. Good luck. Oh, isn't it amazing? Mommy hasn't seen the place up and running in years. Mommy can hardly imagine how exciting Bunzo has been. It's been such a long time since he's been able to play, to cheer, to <laughs> Good luck. Blue, red. Blue, 
red, yellow, blue, red, yellow, blue. Round two, green, red, green, red, yellow, green, red, yellow, red. Motherfucker. Wanna hear a dino joke? Click once for the question. Click again for the punchline. <laughs> okay, that's right. What do you call a dino with one eye? Uh, do you think he saw us? <laughs> not bad, not bad. What do you call a dinosaur who's a noisy sleeper? A Tyrannosaurus. <laughs> not bad, not bad. I like it. What do you call the scariest dinosaur? T-Rex. E. No. Ah. Oh. Look, you can see. Um, I don't know why, but it's like rejected somehow. Yeah. Next day I got demoted down here. 
to the freaking island of misfit toys! Why do I talk to myself? I don't know. Those are morons. You can say that. Yes, they are. They reject so much toys. But it's good toys, I guess. Okay. Let's go. Interesting. By the way, yeah, let's go. Let's click from down here. Hello, egg. Ah, let's play. Nice. Let's go up. I don't know. Whoa, you did fantastic. Thank you. Who gave you permission to be this smart? <laughs> Myself. Mommy is super proud of you. Uh, I'm sure she's already told you that herself. No. Our next game is Waggo Wuggy. Fuck you. Head downstairs. Have fun. I have enough fun. This is fucking stop. It's not fun. Oh, fuck you. It will be no fun. It will be no fun. I can say that. Welcome to Wacko Wuggy. This advanced test is designed to assess the extent of your reactionary abilities. A dual palm grab pack will be provided to you for this test. Around you are 18 sizable holes. An adorable Huggy Wuggy toy could appear out of any one of these holes. If one comes out, hit it with your grab pack. That's all. Good luck. Yeah, I need it. Fucking need it. Luck. The toys in this game used to have strings attached to them, so they could be pulled back when they got too close to the children. Hmm. Have fun. Fuck you. Fuck you. You should play this one, my friend. It's not an easy one to play alone. I will die soon, so I will skip moment and I win it. Yeah. If I survive.
of those cats. Good lord. Years ago, as you can see. No, it's not. Hi. How are you doing? Open, 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 motherfucker. Open, 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 open. Yes, no. Come on. Yes. Yes. Don't you dare. Don't. Don't. Come. Come on, come on. Come on. And good. He's gone. Why? Why? I took a peek beneath the gate 
and some massive bloody thing was dothering about the bloody hallway. Thing? You're sure it wasn't a person? Ain't no person that's 50 feet long with a thousand legs. Marcus, you're losing me. Maybe you just saw a bunch of people walking by. Look, it wasn't people, all right? I haven't a bloody notion what it was, but it wasn't human. Hmm. Who have you told about this? Besides me, obviously. Just you, sir. Obviously. Okay. I'll have security skim the cameras and take a look. What? There's a massive bloody monster! Skimming ain't gonna get rid of it! You're out of line, Marcus. We make toys, not monsters. Now come on, get out of my sight. Actually, uh, grab me a coffee, will you? Actually, never mind, get out of my sight. Sorry guys, um, we're making that sound. And then, of that, uh... Of that blade. God damn it. Go, keep going. Fuck you. I don't like that game at all. I will make it faster. Yeah. Yes, need to go. The fuck. Keep go. I'm just making a uh Happening this to me. Yeah.
welcome to statues. This advanced obstacle course is designed to test your physical endurance and strength. The rules are simple. The lights will turn off. You can move through the obstacle course at this time. However, when the lights turn on, you can look around but cannot move. You may move again once the lights turn back off. The lovable PJ Pugapillar will follow you. If PJ reaches you, your test is over. That's all. Good luck. It was always so sad to see the kids go. They called me Mommy because I was the closest thing they ever had to one. But they'd come for games and never come back. They left Mommy to die alone. Mommy didn't deserve that. Deserve that. But you, you worked here. Did I? So if anyone deserves to die alone, it's you. Did I work here? Excuse me? Uh... You should take middle. But if you want to go, go to this way. As you can see, the goal. <laughs> Fuck. I accidentally move. You need to not move. Yeah. What the fuck is prototype? No. Fuck you. Well, you don't know, see my eyes. Well, well, we don't see him again when he walk in the wall. Well, we don't see him again when he walk in the wall. And then I'm walking somehow there. If you die, you don't see him again. Sadly. I guess. Fuck you. Fuck you. Uh, fuck. Yeah. They need to call here this one hard. It's not. It's not easy to do. To run. This way. Yeah. When music start, you need to run. If not, stand down. Just stand down. Oh, come on. Para, 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 para. Ah ah. Fuck you.
Oh, fuck you. You never catch me alive. Let's do this one first. Before that. Interesting. Before going there, let's rotate again and watch my tape. Yeah. Jimmy, your work as Playtime Co.'s chief marketing officer has skyrocketed the company's profits. How do you do it? You know, it's not what you'd expect. It's the little things most people don't even think about. Like, take names, for example. I'm surprised people haven't realized this. You take the E sound, slap it on the end of a name, boom, you're making bank. Huggy, mommy. Even Elliot knew this way back with Poppy. I guess I kind oh, blue. of... Blue is huge. I'm telling you. What's your favorite color? Blue? I bet it's blue, right? It's blue? It's green. Okay, well, you're a special case. Most people would say blue. But seriously, marketing is not as easy as you think. I make it look easy. If there's anything Playtime Co. should be known for, it's not toys. It's marketing. Yeah. That's what I'm for doing. I really need... I really need a new mic. And fast. Am I a real boy? Yeah. The robot crossed the road. He was programmed to do it. I love you. I love you. Do you love me? Yes. Dance with me. The button hurts me. <laughs> okay. Recorded announcement to address the many complaints regarding an alleged very, very big spider crawling around in the facility. The 
Playtime Corporation wants me to remind you all that spiders that big do not exist. And that if they did, quote, we would already be dead anyways. End quote. You are. Regardless, you can all rest assured the company is sending some specialists down here to have a look around and relieve the constant whining. Complaining seems to be everyone's primary contribution to this company. It's just a spider. You are all safe. Please, please, carry on with your jobs. Fuck you. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Wee. Just running, fucking running from that monster. Running, 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 running. I don't know why I'm singing. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Help me, somebody help. God damn. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It will be back. Open. God damn it. Yeah, go up, there's a goat. One, two, three, four. And go down. One, two, three, four. Be ready to run up there. Be ready. And ready. Ready to go upstairs here because it's more safe. <coughs> yeah, I don't trust you. Be ready to run this way, be ready. I'm sure you need to be ready, I'm sure. And you press this button. Run.
That's right. That's right. I can. Hello. Like I said before, I was gonna kill you. And yeah, we need to change this one. Look at that boy. So, we not build be um. That ugly, I can say. Well, we will listen to the next uh, final tape. Log code 08502. In relation, experiment 1006, the prototype. A close call occurred this week in which he nearly breached containment. The prototype seemingly disassembled the digital alarm clock within his room and utilized the battery, along with several other components, to create a laser pointer, which he then fired into the security camera, disabling it. These actions allowed him 28.3 seconds completely unmonitored. Once function returned to the camera, the room appeared to be empty. One surveillance specialist went in to confirm his absence. However, Upon opening the door, she realized that the prototype had hidden in one of the camera's blind spots. The prototype attempted to escape through the open door. However, another surveillance specialist was able to remotely relock the door. And they all did. I can go down, but. There's something I need to go here. Yeah, something. Did you kill her? Good. I'll board the train. We need to leave. I'm sure that you need to leave because you're gonna kill me. I don't like it. That was too much fun. Weep. 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 Yeah. I always do that. Like I did the other way, I'm gonna do it this way. Open that door. Come on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This blue. Uh, yellow. Red. No. Okay. That, 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 and that. No. What is wrong with you? Okay. Okay, let's do this my way. Um, blue, uh, yellow. No, okay. Ah, why? Ah. Uh. Uh. What the 
fuck? I just guess that's my gold. Yeah, do do. I will move the camera. I will move the camera this way. So you guys can see. Uh, Yeah. And be careful because it will not be uh fun to watch. Or die. That's all for today. If you want to see part three, yes, I'm not done yet, but I can play. And yeah, that's all for today. Like I said, see ya, and we'll meet next time. Good luck.